down. Guys, we're like over a hundred songs in on this channel, Chris and Dan show. Are we Chris, really? I think so. Chris has yet to uh, rate any of my rap songs that I picked, or any American rap songs for that matter, a nine or a ten. I think that's going to change with this one. I'm surprised no one put in the comments this recommendation. I think people assumed he must have heard it. But I kind of think he hasn't. So I kind of think, and now i got to find a charity. I'm probably going to, I'm going to change my charity to something local where I'm at in Yuma, Arizona, if we do win. Um, I'm going to change it to some someplace local here. Right. I think I have a good chance, guys. And this is all solo by myself. I got to get some more gains, but by myself, I think. Let's see. Warren G featuring Nate Dog, Regulate. This song came out like in early 90s. This song got me a hooked, hooked on Nate Dog and Warren G with this G Funk song sound. We did react to one of their songs before. The very first video we did was Nobody Does It Better, Nate Dog. I think you gave it like a six and a half. You thought it was pretty cool. Okay. Well, this is the one that like is their most famous. Warren G regulate featuring Nate Dog. Rest in peace, Nate Dog. My favorite musician of all time, for those that don't know. Here we go. Your favorite? Nate Dog? Nate Dog's my favorite musician of all time. Yeah. All right. All right. Let me know if you heard this. Rest in peace. I visited his grave and everything. It's in Long Beach. Oh. Okay. Here we go. Regulators. You regulate any stealing of his property. We're damn good, too. But you can't be any geek off the street. Gotta be handy with the steal, if you know what I mean. Earn your keep. Regulators! Mount up. It was a clear black night, a clear white moon. Warmer G was on the streets, trying to consume some skirts for the E. So I could get some phones, rolling in my ride, chilling all alone. Just hit the east side of the LBC, on a mission trying to find Mr. Warren G. Seen a car full of girls, ain't no need to tweak. All of you search know what's up with 213. So I hooked a left on 21 and Lewis, some brothers shooting dice. So I said, let's do this. I jumped out the rock and said, what's up? Some brothers pulled some heat, so I said, I'm since these girls peeping me, I'm gonna glide and swear these looking so right. hard. Out. Yeah. So is this part is this sample off of another song? Because I recognize that. I don't know if that's uh, they this song. did sample like a blues song or something, like a jazz song. So I'm not sure I may have heard this, but that's okay. I'm not positive I've heard this. I've heard that part. I just don't know yeah. if it's from this song. Um, I don't think so. They did sample some blues jazz part. Okay. Um, but they uh, two one three is their group like him, Warren G, Nate, and Snoop. And it's also about Warren G's Dr. Dre's cousin. And it's also about the area code in LA at that time. Okay. Even though they're from Long Beach. Two one and Lewis, some brothers shooting dice. So I said, let's do this. I jumped out the rock and said Oh, and the, you'll see Tupac. This is from a soundtrack of a movie above the rim. Tupac was in it. What's up? Some brothers pulled some heat, so I said I'm stuck. Since these girls peeping me, I'm gonna glide and swerve. These looking so hard, they straight hit the curve. Want to bigger, better things than some horny tricks. I see my homie and some suckers all in his mix. I'm getting jacked. I'm breaking myself. I can't believe they taking Warren's wealth. They took my rings. They took my Rolex. I looked at the brother, said, damn, what's next? They got my homie hemmed up, and they all around. Can't none of them see him if they going straight down for power. They want to come up real quick before they... They start to clown, I best pull out my f- and lay them busters down. They got guns to my head, I think I'm going down. I can't believe it's happening in my own town. If I had wings, I would fly, let me contemplate. I glance in the cut and I see my homie Nate. Sixteen in the th- and one in the hole. Nate Dog is about to make some bodies turn. Now they dropping and yelling, it's a tad bit late. Nate Dog and Warren G had to regulate. Explode. Now I'm switching my mind back into freak mode. If you won't skirt, sit back and observe. I just left a gang of over there on the curb. Now they got the freaks, and that's a known fact. Before I got jacked, I was on the same track. Back up, back up, cause it's on N A T E N me. The woman to the G. Just like I thought they were in the same spot, in need of some desperate head. But Nate Dog and the G Child were in need of something. Else. 
them names were sexy as hell I said, ooh, I like your size She said my chords broke down and just sing real nice Would you let me ride? I got a car full of girls and it's going real swell The next stop is the east side motel Tupac movie is gridlocked. Have you seen it? Uh, yes, I have seen that one. I really like that movie. I've seen it probably three or four times. Yeah, this was from Above the Rim soundtrack. This one really put Snoop and or not Snoop, Warren G and Nate Dogg on the map. Yeah. And it kind of opened up like the East Coast to like see different kind of music from the West Coast besides just Snoop Dogg. Okay. Um, and Dr. Dre, which is this G Funk. Well, it wasn't just so the this came out before NWA? No, this came out after. This came out like in the early ninety. So NWA had nothing to do with the NWA had a lot to do with it. This was like a little different look, you know. Okay. And it's more Long Beach than Compton. Right. It's its own style. It's less less gangster. Less aggressive. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of singing in it. I like the singing parts of that song. Uh, Nate Dogg is my favorite musician of all time, man. Yeah, nice voice. Um, Grew up I, in the gospel gospel singer. Yeah, it sounds like he could be a gospel singer. Absolutely. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he's got a nice singing voice. Um, too bad that uh, they couldn't just sing in the rap songs, like sing, sing, right? Like he's doing in the chorus. Right. You'd have a much better chance of getting the nine that, that way. <laughs> uh, just pure singing? <laughs> yeah, but rap, right? I don't know if that's even possible. Like Drake. Drake does that. Yeah, but he's singing when he's singing. He's not rapping. You know I see. Saying? So what do you want? Them to sing? Yeah, I don't know. I don't think it's possible. Yeah, but, I don't uh, think it's possible. Yeah, uh, I'm confusing as hell. So uh, this song I would probably give uh, seven seven wow you gave nobody does it better a seven and a half yeah wow okay so this is considered by man well this is definitely their most popular song yeah both of Nate like Dog i said i think i probably heard this before not positive huh? though yeah, you would know you would know no no not for sure but i've definitely heard whatever it is they're sampling and i think i've yeah. heard the chorus part of it too you guys put in the comments what they're sampling um I think that, I mean, to me, this is a 10 out of 10. Easy 10 out of 10. Easy. Yeah, because you own it. You love it. I love right? it. Yeah. I love the sound and everything. But Chris says seven, which is not bad. You know, seven is very good for Chris's scores. For, for rap, yeah. Yeah. Well, one song I almost bought. So I, I considered it, and I just couldn't do it. But It was Buntug's Come Home with Phil Collins. Yeah, that one. That yeah. one was that one was right there. You can't get any closer. Mm, if, I, if I liked it two percent more, I would have bought it. We'll get closer. We'll get closer, guys, and you're gonna help me in the comments. All right. So like, subscribe, comment, share. We got tons more to get to, but put yours in there. I look at all of them. Yep. And so does Chris. At some point, I'm have to put together um, um, little clips of all the rap songs I like. There isn't that many. There's like twenty. I'll put together all of them. And here it is. This is the songs that I've actually purchased. <laughs> All right. I think I got some uh, more good ones up my sleeve too for you. All right. So. All right. Had to do this one. Catch you guys later. Thanks for watching. <laughs>